stay at home orders have many people questioning what's essential and what isn't, and that includes local business owners. CBS 17's Holden Kerwicki joins us now outside the GNC store in North Hills where they're fighting to keep their doors open. Holden, have they closed yet? Uh, Angela, at this time, the location is still open, and they're actually doing curbside delivery to people who don't feel safe coming inside of the store, but at this time, it's not clear exactly how much longer they're going to be able to keep those doors open. Back in March, the Department of Homeland Security classified stores that sold vitamins as essential since they are considered a form of alternative health care. However, today, Laura Dalton, who owns seven GNC franchises locally, was forced to close her Holly Springs and Fuquay locations because she was was told they were deemed non-essential. She says she won't simply let this go without a fight. I would never just accept something, let it go, that I feel so strongly about. And I'm hoping that the conversations with the attorney's office will lead to just being hopefully just closed for a day so we can go back out in the community and continue to serve. I reached out to Wake County District Attorney Lauren Freeman today, and she told me that the order to close didn't come from her office, but rather it came from the State Emergency Operations Center. Now coming up tonight at 6, I'm digging deeper to try and get this local owner some answers about whether or not she can keep her business open. Live in Raleigh, Holden Kerwicki, CBS 17 News.